We thank you that everybody came with an expectant heart to see you, to hear you. That they'll be refilled. This is a refilling station throughout the week, Lord God. I know some people might have came in tired, but man, just a drink of you can replenish and refill. So we just thank you for the refill. God, we thank you for the refill. You're so welcomed in this place, Holy Spirit. We are nothing without you. Thank you for allowing us to be vessels and that, God, you chose us as your children. Thank you, Jesus, for dying on the cross that we can have a relationship with the Father. We always want to honor you before we start a service. We want to honor you throughout the service. Keep our eyes focused on you, Lord God, because these four walls don't matter if your presence isn't here, if we're not focused on you. So that's where we are, Lord God. We surrender our hearts. We surrender our minds. Everything that we came in here with, Lord God, shake it off. Shake it off, Lord God, and keep us focused on you. In Jesus' name, amen. Come on, how many of y'all want to shout out Jesus? Come on, shout out his name, Jesus! <laughs> oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus!
scripture in the Bible that says he that the son is set free he's free indeed come on we're just gonna worship Jesus tonight I don't know what you came here tonight but maybe you need a breakthrough with Jesus father God we need breakthrough Lord God father we have freedom and tonight we walk in it Jesus thank you because we are free Choose to live. 
lift up our voices to you because you died on the cross for us, Jesus. Thank you for the freedom that you bought, that we couldn't buy on our own. So many men and women in the Old Testament tried to do it, but they couldn't do it. But here you come, Jesus. Savior of the world. Savior of the world. So obedient. Thank you for your obedience to the Father. To win the race, to defeat death. that in your name there is breakthrough in your name there is deliverance in your name there is healing in your name there is victory over any situation that we may be walking through so we surrender everything to you Lord and we cast all our cares on you and we say do what only you can do How many of you standing in a need for a breakthrough? How many of you need deliverance? How many of you need healing? He's the God of the impossible. He's a way maker, a miracle worker, a promise keeper. He is the light in the darkness. So we just thank you right now, Jesus. For bridging that gap. So we can commune with the Father. In Jesus' name, amen.
There will be 
doesn't matter about your neighbors. It's all about Jesus. doesn't matter about us on this stage. It's all about Jesus. doesn't matter about what's going on outside of these four walls. It's all about Jesus. At this very moment, I just challenge you to just sit still in the quiet and ask him to speak to you. What is he saying to you? Not what is he saying to your neighbor for you, but what is he saying specifically to you? You can go after him yourself. Jesus, we just thank you for speaking to your congregation today. you write it down Lord I just thank you for speaking to each person in this place Lord I just pray for those who don't even know your voice that you reveal yourself to them tonight that they will know your voice they will hear from you and they will write down what you say and see it come to pass us a people that long after you, that has a heart after you, a desire after you, a fire that burns within us for you and you alone. That we are not man pleasers, Lord God, but we are God pleasers, that we want to be more like Christ every day. Holy Spirit, take us by the hand every day. Help us to walk in your fruit. 
that is evident in our walk. Lord, cleanse us. Help us to repent daily and turn away from wicked ways that are not like you. Because you are perfect in all of your ways. God, thank you for calling us sons and daughters so that we can walk the path of righteousness. What would we do without you? Nothing. us to lay down our lives like Jesus did and to surrender our flesh to you. Thank you for free will, but we choose your will over ourselves, Lord God. We give it back and say, let your will be done in our lives, Lord God. Give us your heart to desire. You are so worthy and so holy none like you, there never will be, there never was. So here's our gift back to you, lifting up our voices to you, saying praise be to the Lord Jesus. Praise to the God of the heavens. Praise to the God of the earth. Our King, to our King, to our King. 
social media community, watch full broadcasts, sign up for our daily devotional, and much more at miracleplace.org.